Howdy y'all, Lone Star Rider here. I've got a product review, part two. Y'all stick around. I gotta go get it. Lone Star Rider on his motorcycle. Raising money, making friends. Seeing the country into it. Lone Star Rider. The LS2 helmet. I did a review on this about two years ago, and I was supposed to follow up after a couple of months, and I never did. So I've been wearing this helmet for a couple of years, and it's a great helmet. Uh, I'm getting ready to replace it, because this one was in the accident I had about four months ago. And you're, it's got a little scrape on it, but you're supposed to replace them after that. Um, usually you have a five-year use of them and then you'd get another helmet that and usually that's the standard warranty on helmets too it's been a great helmet it's been lighter uh, i don't get headaches if i wear like i wore the the shark helmet if i wore it over a four appear four over four hours i would start getting a headache you know take a break and stop but normally I don't ride that long anyway. Wow. This one, I don't even get a headache at all. And it fits really well on my head. And of course, you have to get helmets that fit to your head anyway. So I'm thinking that it's either the shape or the weight, because this is a pound lighter than the Shark Evalon 3 that I was wearing. I understand they make a model now that's a lot lighter. Uh, but this helmet is great. It, it is a three-quarter and a full face helmet. And it is also DOT approved both ways. So it's good. Uh, instead of cracking, these, when they get hit, they dent. And uh, from the material they make, I'll put it what it is right here. I'm not quite sure. The only thing that I've, I don't like about this helmet here is that i don't know if you can see it see this white stuff here i don't know if this is a mold or what it is but when you scratch on it it comes off and it goes black so i'm not sure what it is and i've cleaned it all off i don't know if it's a mildew or a mold or what it is if y'all know what it is tell me um but other than that it doesn't bother me one bit the cena bluetooth i have which doesn't have a dial on it i don't know where it went works well with this helmet mounted on here. Uh, it does a, a really good job of staying on here and it doesn't fall off a whole bit. So, the, the shield's been working great. The noise level on this helmet is probably medium. You still hear wind noise and stuff when you have it on with the full face. Uh, you still hear it, but it's not real bad. Some hel helmets just block it all off. This one doesn't. So if that's gonna bother you, you might want to uh, not get this helmet. Uh, but the helmet itself is awesome. Did I say it was awesome? This is a great helmet. I love this quick connect. And it just works great. Uh, the face shield, when you put up the back part here, works great. Got a little red button down here you push, and it releases it and comes up. If you have this down, it raises it up so it can close and lock. And I don't have to fiddle with it a lot. It just latches in real good uh, for that. So take a look at this here. This is my two year review after owning this helmet. Oh, one more thing. Yeah, the uh, sunshade. Works great, love it. Doesn't touch my nose <laughs> like it did on the other helmet. I don't want to cut down the the Shark Evalon 3 too much because I really did like that helmet a lot. Uh, being a three-quarter and a full face, 
and you don't have to carry an extra helmet with you uh, when you're on the road full time is absolutely awesome. It saves you space. So really good stuff. I highly, highly recommend this LS2 uh, Dalit. I think that's what it's called, Dalit helmet. This LS2 uh, three-quarter and full-face helmet is great. I want to thank Riders, Bikers, and Supplies for donating this helmet. I did not pay for it. They did not pay me to do this review. Um, and they did not ask me to do a review. I did the review. Uh, this is a donation from one of my sponsors, Chris, from Riders, Bikers, and Supplies. So thank you very much for the donation and the awesome helmet. It's great. Guys, if y'all are not subscribed to me, y'all should be. Click on that subscribe button down below and then hammer the hell out of that bell and you'll get an email notification that I've uploaded a video. And if you like this video, give it a big thumbs up, share, comment, let me know what you think. Catch y'all on the road here in Fort Worth, Texas. <laughs> I'm home down. Let's see, what else do I need to say? I don't know. Is there anything else? It's just a great, great helmet. It uh, fits well. And... Hey. Awesome. Right, let's go over here. No, over here. Up. Oh, no, over here. Over here.